team, you know, and uh, they played well. They played well in the second half also. But uh, we still, I think we should have won that game. What did you see on the, on the cross of the full court pass to Wendell that, that made you want to throw it? And then when you threw it, did you did you say, oh, man, I want that back? <laughs> uh, yeah, definitely. Um, I seen it for a split second. And... Uh, I threw it, you know, I just, I seen it for a split second, he was open, and then I remember that as soon as it was on my fingertips, like, damn, I shouldn't have thrown that pass, you know, because uh, they all get back on defense um, right away, so uh, that pass really didn't have a chance. Going off along that, when Marvin hits that three, I think that puts you guys down by two, you know, what's kind of going through your mind is I think it's seven seconds left to go, and they're going to the line there. Um, what's going through my mind is that, uh, you know, I, I th throughout the whole game, I thought we was going to win. I kind of knew we was going to win. Um, but when he hit that three, you know, I just saw, damn, this is college basketball. So, you know, we got to keep it going and play some defense, and hopefully something spectacular can happen. And this is, you know, you, you'd seen a similar defense in Miami, but this is the best defense in the country. I know it just ended, but where are maybe some things you can take from this, or did you learn from playing such a pressure and, and tough defense like that? Um, I feel as if uh, we've all, we have all learned a lot. Um, you know, we learned that. Playing against really good teams like Virginia uh, tells us that you know we have to be sharp all the time. We have to be smart with the ball. Um, we have to make free throws and do all the little things like rebounds, stuff like that, to beat team really good teams like that.